Stella. I, I know you're busy and everything. It's just, um, I didn't know whether to bring this and honey. I just have got time to drop everything so that Peggy can talk about hats. Yeah, yeah, of course. That's mum's, isn't it? Let's just hope that's the worst of your problems, eh? I can't cope. I can't cope with all of this. All of what? I feel bullied and prodded and pushed about. Yeah, yeah, I know. I mean, maybe to keep the peace, maybe you should just give her a bell, eh? My mother is a very busy woman, Billy. Yeah. Look, Stella, if... if you ever need to talk to me about anything, I mean, especially now we're gonna be family. Oh, don't be ridiculous. How is that gonna help? Sometimes I don't know if it takes. Do you, uh, fancy buying me a pint? Uh, no, I can't, mate. I'm off out somewhere. Well, where to? Italian lessons. I Italian lessons? What, what, what I thought? <sighs> to broaden my horizons. Well, since when? A couple of weeks. Oh, and this from the bloke that didn't know that Spag Bottle was short for something. Ah, oh, at last. Yes, it is. Well, you said that last week. Yeah, well, it better be, because you don't want me to come down there and collect it, do you? No, you don't. Thank you very much. Goodbye. All right, believe me, listen, make it lively. Only me and Stella are going out tonight, and uh, I want to lock up a bit sharp this morning. Okay. Is something wrong with that? No, no, it's, um... Well, it's just that uh, I heard something. What about... Well, me? Well, yeah, and, um... Well, I, I was talking to Stella, you know, about what happened to her head. Come on, Billy, spit it out. You're beginning to wind me up. Now, has someone said I've heard Stella or something? No, of course not. I mean, I... I, I, I Come on, where did you hear this? Nowhere. Now, who's been telling stories, eh? Was it Bill? Phil. Phil. Give you a fright, did I? Oh, you've been saying that I pick on people weak to me. Let's find out if that's true, shall we? I've just been saying what everybody else has been thinking. Jane will be back in a minute. Phil. It's all right. I ain't gonna touch him. You're not? I thought we was getting on. For Ben's sake. I mean, did you think about how he'd feel it if he got wind of this? Maybe you should have thought of that before. Yeah, maybe you should have thought before accusing another member of my family. <laughs> Who was it last time? It was Stella, wasn't it? Yeah, I'm trying to be a, a good dad to Ben. Stella's gonna, gonna be a great mum. And I swear, I swear, I would never lay a finger on her. If you put it like that. Yeah, but I also swear that if I have one more bad word about me and Stella from anyone, then I'm going to come back here, rearrange this gaff with you as a centerpiece. You got that? Appreciate it. Uh, Stella, cab's here. Listen, do us a favour. Pop down and tell Charlie I'll be two minutes. I've just got to finish this, yeah? Stella. Look, I, 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 we've got reservations, Peggy. I'm but it'll only it. take a minute. 